Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol ADMP. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. If you're new to charts and not sure what I mean by 30 minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link, so you can go there and I'll explain in detail. Overall today, rough day, especially after the very nice movement on Thursday. But there was definitely a silver lining in you know today's you know price action from a trading standpoint, and that's the fact that you got to give credit where credit's due. The price had a very impressive bounce. I mean, you stop and think about the fact that the price was actually all the way down there, but by the time the the closing bell rang, price had worked its way all the way up there. Don't get me wrong; there's still plenty of work to be done. But you also have to admit that yeah, that was definitely a, a very solid bounce. But that does lead to the more than valid question of: but is there any sort of true power behind this bounce? Is there any sort of genuine strength? Or is this just some sort of knee-jerk reaction, you know, dead cat bounce type movement? I have no idea, but like I said, by using charts, we can make mapping out that question very straightforward. And in my mind, it all revolves around a single area. And that area is down here at, let's see, what is that? 68 cents. Why is 68 at a, you know, such an important level? Well, hopefully we can all agree on the logic that price movements with genuine power, with true strength, the price is gonna progress forward. The price is not gonna go back to where it was. So with that in mind, think about 68. If the price were to come down to 68, and then just continue on down, what would that be doing to the price? Well, from a very literal perspective, that'd be putting the price right back inside of this range that it hasn't seen for quite a while. And you know, of course it saw it this morning, but that's where the bounce all started. You don't wanna see the price going back to where that bounce from this morning started. Whereas on the flip side of things, let's say that the price, cause nothing can go straight up, so it pulls back. However, in this situation, it behaves like that before it's starting to work its way back upwards. Now all of a sudden, what would you have? Well, you'd have a set of lows right there. You'd have that low right there if you envision each of those as stair steps. Well, hey, there you go. Now you have stair steps progressing in the upward direction. And again, that's what a truly strong move is gonna do. It's gonna make progress forward. And again, in this situation, quote unquote progress, I'm defining as 68 cents. What about levels of resistance? Initial level of resistance, if this bounce continues, gonna be right there at the 75 cent mark, which is essentially where the price struggled from there. If you go back here through the history, you can see you know, price struggled with it, price struggled with it. Um, and then when the price actually did break above it, that's what really you know got the momentum going there. But 75 cents in the near term, gonna be that first key level if the price can break up through there. Next key area after that, right up there around the 80 cent mark. So all in all, yeah, rough day compared to where it was on Thursday, but an interesting day today given you know the bounce. So let's see if the price can build upon this momentum next week or not. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.